Welcome to K1 World Grand Prix 2022 in Japan at Yokohama Tsuri at the Yokohama Arena. I'm Russell Goro and I have with me Nicholas Pettis. This is a K1 Super Welterweight a fight uh, between Abidar Himalayan Cheetah versus Jump Tom Striker Gym from Thailand. This is going to be an interesting one. We have uh, Abidar uh, fighting out of originally from Nepal but in Japan and now we are against the Jump Tom who is been at Muay Thai, he's, he's had uh, wins in the WBC. He was, uh, as a 14 year old, he was a, 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 a Muay Thai champion. There's no idea. And then ever since champion. that, he's got four different belts and four different titles, went to boxing. His fight record is absolutely crazy. 206 wins. Absolutely. 206 Go check him out wins. on the internet. Don't take our word for it because there's too much to know about it. <laughs> too much information. Yeah. There he is preparing and, for and the please, fight. Stay in your seat because there's a lot going to happen in this wow. fight. Trust me on this one. <gasps> And there's a lot of a height difference here, which is actually quite... Um, 10 centimeters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, uh, the Himalayan cheetah is really tall, 185. In this weight class, it's huge. And 11 years in difference for... <laughs> now, oh, I told you to stay seated. You Don't you go out for coffee. Oh, man. What a kick. Scariness. No one is from the striker. Oh. oh, man. There's something about a fighter that is just that strong and confident. And why would you want to walk in there? Boy, <laughs> <laughs> mm. oh, another okay, high that, kick. That could have been. And the next one might be. It just keeps you holding your breath because you want to see what's about to happen. Oh, goodness, yeah. Don't get me wrong, the Himalayan mm. Cheetah is always bringing on a yeah. good fight. I just think maybe this is the wrong, different level. Oh my god, <laughs> it just almost got clipped there again. Classical Muay Thai. He's also no. got title belts in, yeah. uh, in, in boxing. In so boxing, right? Yeah. He can cope with the hood punches and slipping mm. and stuff. Oh, nice shot again. Nice. Oh. <laughs> gotta tell you, he's got heart. He's going for it. Okay, wow, wow. You think it's like. Uh, oh my goodness. 207th win. You know what he said in the press conference? Well, what did he say? Yeah, what did he say? He said, you know, I'm going to fight anyone. I could probably take three belts in K1. I don't care <laughs> what the weight is. So he'll come down or go up? Yeah, he said wait. go up, go down, whatever it takes. I kind of believe him. <laughs> <laughs> it was convincing. Wow, oh, he's still down. Down on the... My goodness. Okay. I hope he's okay. I want to see the last one in slow motion because I think he got kicked in the head right at the end. After yes. he got punched. There, there he goes. Oh. Wait, what? That one? This one. This, this one. That's the second one? No. Oh, no, no. That's no. the first one. This one there. now. So now he's going to get punched. Boom. Boom. And then he falls. Holds it. 
And then he gets it right in the chin. Is it the chin? Yeah. Yeah. Bam. Punch. Oh, and he's still trying on to the hold ropes. on, but look at that. Bang. Oh, oh, see? So precise to the I chin. I mean, it would have been over regardless. How did that knock him out? He didn't even kick him in the chin in that first game. Where was that look. one? Like, that's like the that's, arm? He kicked his arm, yeah. and the arm, and his punch, his uh, own his, hand knocked him out. His own hand. Wow. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. This is why I don't fight anymore. <laughs> <laughs> We've seen enough. Oh, man. I'm We've just seen the damage. Oh, man. This is going to be interesting to see his journey through the K1. And he's not young. He's 33. Yeah. yeah. So, you know, time might be limited, but I think we'll see more of him. Wow. What, what, a, what a knockout. Let's see what he says. Sorry, Kaab. Tell you that's probably a hello. Sorry, Kaab. Three years ago, we came back. I'm going to say K1 70, 67, 65. He said it again, and he probably can and will. You know who I'd like him to see fight? Who? Uh, the other one. Ah, uh, Gonna go 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 yeah. yeah. Yeah, man. What, what? Have to ask K1 if that's possible. Thank you for watching. This was uh, the K1 World Grand Prix 2022 in Japan. Yokohama, the winner there was Tom Tom Striker Jim. This was Russell Goodall and Nicholas Pettis.